I get invited to an Instagram group chat, and it's only one thing in the group chat, and it's a video of my game. And so, I seen that video. Damn. Sat on it for a little bit. I didn't know what to do with it. And I went to TK and asked him for advice, pretty much. And he had told me to basically ghost Shorty. That's what I did. I ghosted her. And I said, like, Damn. a week later, Shot. Yo, I'm sorry, bro. It, yo, it's one thing to hear that somebody clapping your girl cheeks, but it's another thing to see it on video. Oh my God! That's how that's how serial killers are created, bro. Damn, that shit hurt me. Mm. I already pulled up to my career. Mind you, we were together for four years, so she knows where I live. Is this part two or this is part one? This part, this part, this part two. I'm, I'm going into part two now. So, so she pulled up to my crib. Mind you, it's like three bitches in the car. Why are you coming to my house with all these bitches in the car? What's going on? Hold on. Wait, so hold on. Flag in the plate. What made her come to your crib? Because TK told me to not take her no more. To like just ghost her at that point. Oh, she just popped up on you? Yeah. Okay, continue. So, she gets out the car. Mind you, my mom works from home. And if my mom had seen her, I would have had to tell, like, tell her what was going on. I didn't want to like involve her in that shit. So I go outside, and I'm like, yo, what's this about? Like, why are you doing this? Like, there's no reason to pull up in my house under nice, bro. Like, chill out. She starts yelling at me, telling me I'm ruining our relationship. I'm doing this. I'm doing that. A whole bunch of bullshit, right? So I tell Shawty, like, there's no need to be doing all of this. I know you cheated on me. Like, I seen the video. There's no point of you even, like, doing all this. Like, go home. Okay, well, Shawty tried. Hey, hey, no disrespect, bro. No disrespect, but like, like, what was the video type shit? <laughs> so, <laughs> hold on. So it was me and her, and the, it was him and her in the back of the Hellcat. And she was like, She never let me do any of that. Like, every time we did stuff, I was protected. He hit, he hit the kitty cat in the kitty cat? Hold on, bro. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. He said something that I, I, I want to touch on. He said something that I want to touch on. He said, she never let me do any of that. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, bro. You and your girl could be together for years. You might have all these type of things in your imagination that you want to do with your woman, bro. And she going to be like, nah, I'm not trying to do that. Nah, you doing too much, right? As soon as she get with this new nigga, bro, bro, they going to be doing all types of under the sun. And you know what she going to do when she talk to her friends? Oh my God, he's such, excuse me. Oh my God, he's so adventurous. This is such a new experience for me. Like my my other nigga was not ever trying to do any of these things. Like, I'm, bro, she gonna go all out for this, this dude that she just started talking to. You know, your replacement. You remember you want her to, to wake up at four in the morning and, and give you, the, you know what I'm saying, give you the, you know, you feel me, give you that special treatment, and she just, oh my God, like, I don't feel like, I'm not in the mood, like, why you keep bothering me about this, and when she do it, she over there, doing it like she don't, you know, like, it, it's a job, she doing it like it's a job, she not, she don't enjoy it, but as soon as she get with this new nigga. As soon as she get with this new nick, she gonna be putting that thing in the back of her damn throat. Gonna be popping that thing in her goddamn mouth like 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 uh like a tic tac, bro. Oh baby, you gonna? I, I, I want you to let, let me. I'm just letting you know, bro. 
I'm letting you know. It's situations where your girl might be topping you off. And y'all, we grow, we all grown here. This video might fuck around and get demonetized, bro. We all grown here, bro. So your girl doing you, giving you the special treatment, right? Now, when it's coming to the end of that special treatment, I hate it when a female, a woman, giving you the special treatment and she don't, she, she don't see it all the way through. She don't see it all the way through. She get the, are you close? Okay. Instead of seeing it all the way through, okay? I'm speaking in codes. I hope you understand what I'm saying. I'm telling you right now that when she get with that new nigga, she is seeing it all the way through. She might swallow. I'm letting you know right now she might swallow. I'm saying all of that to say, ladies, why is it that when you with your, your guy and he's trying to do all these adventurous things, you're not with it, but then once you get with the new dude, you turn into a whole new person? The reason why that bothers me is like, you rather do all this shit for a stranger and not for a dude who loves you. And the crazy thing about that is that the fact that you don't want to do all those things, and <laughs> I'm not saying it's okay, but a lot of times that's why niggas be cheating. Niggas don't cheat because they, they love these bitches they cheating with. No, they cheat because they want to explore their, their sexual fantasies, and you, as who's supposed to be his woman, his corn star, you know what I'm saying? His in-house corn star. You don't want to fulfill that role. So now he got to go out there and get him a little freak. And you know, these side bitches don't got no morals. She trying to take your man. So any little devious thing that he can think about, she down. She down to do it. I just had to let that get that off my chest. Yes, I, straight up. And I told you, Shadi, I seen a video type shit. She, she tried to lie. She said, what video? And I sat there in silence like, bro, you know what I'm talking about. And she was like, who sent you the video? So I'm like, why do you, like, you just tried to lie to me that quick. Like, what's going on? So I pulled my phone out, showed her that shit. And it went from her being mad at me to her apologizing. Her saying it was a moment of weakness. She'll never do it again. It's a lie. Whole bunch of bullshit. It's a lie. Right. So I tell her like, yo, straight up, I don't want nothing to do with you. Like, Leave my shit. I'm been like, I'm going back inside. We're done. I delete my number. All of that. I'm done. It's whatever. Right. As I'm finna turn around to go back in my house, bitch told me she was pregnant. Oh my god. Oh my Whoa. god. And I, Wait, no, no, no. I didn't hear this one. Is this part two or part one? Yeah, this is part two. So I. How, wait, no. How long is this? It's like... I've never gone raw. The only thing that gone raw is that. Just for... Like... Yeah. So I hear that shit, and I'm like, yo, don't call the other about that kid. It's not mine. And I walk back in my house. I thought I ate shit up. I thought I really, like, did shit for real. I thought I was done with shit. Like, yeah. I never gonna hear from her again. Yeah. The next day... They didn't give me a day break. The next day, my mom calls me in her room. Mind you, 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 you get called by your parents. That's foul. She told I'm his mom. Oh, no. Don't say it. Don't say what I think you're about to say, bro. Bro, she she did that. That motherfucker, like, she damn near yelled. And I'm like, fuck. She I'm what? This. She basically yelled at me to come, like, to come to her room. Okay. I'm like, damn. It's over for me. So I go in there, and she's like, not even no hey hello did you get Gabby pregnant mm. and I was like oh. mm, 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 mm. Bro, she told your mom that yeah cause since me and shorty been going out for so long when we were young our parents knew each other alright so I'm assuming she went home and told her mama and her mom called my mom but it's not your mom it's not yours though 
it's not. Well, at the time, I'm like, yeah, it's not mine. That's fine. So, so I, I trade it from my, I'm telling my mom, yo, it's not my kid. Like, like you don't got to worry about that. Mind you, before that, I don't even think my mom knew I was having sex before any of that. So for that to come out like that, I was like, damn. But what you mean at the time you thought it was yours? At the time, I was like, bro, this shit. Like, oh, no, at the, time, at the time you knew it wasn't yours. I knew it wasn't mine. Like, it was like, yeah, this set in stone is not my kid. And so I'm trying to plead to my mom, but like, yo, like, yo, it's not my kid. I've, I've been protected this whole time. It's just other than she just fucked. And I had to show my mom that shit, too. Oh, he had to show his mom and the my, video. As I'm trying to explain to her, I can look at her face and knew, like, she wasn't going for it. Like, she didn't believe me. That's, she just thought it was my kid. And that so, low key hurt, because it's like, man, that's my mom. Like, you don't believe me, the son? So, so it's not, it's not yours. You're good, right? Yeah, yeah, Nowadays, yeah, I'm, I'm sure it's not my kid. I'm free. <laughs> Damn, Cause I'm free, bro. And you not in the booth yet? You literally got an eight boogie story, bro. <laughs> hey man, I went viral on TikTok. That's pretty much it. Damn. No, no, I had to go through all the ultrasounds, all the appointments. I had to go to the baby shower. And Damn, it like I was a father with the Burberry oh, shirt. Shit. What? No. Wait, wait, wait. With the you went to the baby shower and act like he was a father? Bro. <laughs> yes. Oh! No. No, no, no. You're lying. You caught Burberry. A Burberry you had a Burberry shirt on. <laughs> and the Burberry shirt on. Oh, oh my. Hey. Hey, bro. I think I'm the only person who had a baby shower and did not wear a Burberry shirt. I don't know what it is about that Burberry shirt, but it's like the go-to for baby showers. <laughs> All right, but um, with that being said, man, young men, be careful out here, dog. Be very careful out here. Um, a lot of mistakes can be made because we're all humans, but. At the same time, when you are young and, you know, you still want to look a certain type of way in your parents' eyes, like, young women don't want to look like whores. Even though a lot of them do whorish, have whorish ways, they do not want to look like whores in their parents' eyes. So, if they're... If they can pin a baby on you, they will. That's what happened to him. She she knew she messed up. And <laughs> she knew that a lot of people would judge her if they found out that situation. You had your boyfriend. Y'all been together for a while. You in here like getting getting them cheeks clapped in the back of somebody Hellcat. You have a baby for this, for this dude. Like, you know, that's... <laughs> That's, that could have ended very bad. That could have ended very bad, bro. I know somebody who... Well, I know the guy who was actually the father. He was actually the father. Okay? This chick was married. I don't know if they worked together or whatever the situation is. But he ended up clapping them... He ended up clapping them married cheeks. He got her pregnant. She made her husband feel as though the baby was his. And I remember dude showing me the picture and he like, bro, like, I think this is my son. And I looked at the picture and I was like, yeah, bro, he looks just like you. He's like, yeah, but she married and, you know, she got her husband thinking that that's his, son, that's his child. At the time he showed me that picture, I want to say the little boy was about six, six years old. Recently... I went on uh, Facebook, and he popped up on my feed, and I see it's him with his daughter, and the little the little boy. Well, who the little boy is actually like twelve or thirteen now, so I feel as though um, it looks as though she came clean. He probably forced her to come clean, bro. Cause his pride, he wouldn't he wouldn't let another man take care of his child. I feel as though he did, he he did do it for about six years. 
You feel me? He did do it for about six years, but maybe he had a, a, a life-changing experience and decided, hey, this can't continue. 